Hello, it's Graham from Tabletop Heroes here again. Uh, just thought I'd spend a few moments today uh, opening up for you a governor booster from the Walking Dead All Out War, so you can have a look inside and see what you actually get. So this set comes with three figures in the box. Uh, firstly, the titular character from the, the box itself, the governor, Brian Blake. Uh, this is Brian Blake maimed and mutilated. As you can see, it's quite a nice dynamic pose actually on this figure. Uh, he's got his foot resting up there on a box, pointing, he's wearing his riot armour, he's got a uh, pistol in a side holster, uh, obviously he is uh, missing an arm, and if you can see, I don't know if the camera will pick it up on here, the patch on his eye uh, is, is nice and clearly sort of sculpted in there, I think this is quite a nice looking figure, I'm going to look forward to painting this one, okay so there's the mutilated Brian Blake, the governor, um, hopefully no spoilers, um, but you also get Penny, his daughter, uh, who obviously is a, a walker, there, there you go, so that's uh, quite a nice, again, a nice figure, I think that's going to be a simple one to uh, paint up, <clears throat> I've already got ideas of doing like a sort of flowery summer dress stained with blood on her, uh, I think that's going to be a bit of fun to paint that one. And then one of uh, his lieutenants, one of his uh, gang members, we have Gloria. And again, a nice dynamic pose. Again, I don't know if the camera will pick this up, but she seems to be kind of calling out as she's taking a two-handed shot with her automatic pistol there. Uh, and again, nice, clear, crisp sculpt. And uh, like all of these uh, figures that I'm getting in from Mantic, they really take to being painted really well. Uh, I've been really pleased with these today. So there you go, three figures in there. Obviously you get a selection of uh, character and equipment cards, which I'm going to show you now. So the main one being Brian Blake, 62 points worth of Brian Blake's card there. Okay, you can see he's got uh, high nerve, a uh, good selection of dice on the melee shoot and defense uh, abilities. Uh, he has a leader ability, and a couple of special abilities I'll tell you about there. So, his first special ability is Executioner, uh, which basically means that if someone or a, uh, a character has become prone, when he attacks, he doesn't need to roll for the attack, he just kills them, uh, which is a bit unfortunate for them. And um, also, they, uh, if he does the execution, he gets to add a red die to a special pull which relates to one of the uh, other abilities on this card. Uh, and then he also hates cowardness. So any friendly model within six inches that is panicking uh, will suffer his wrath if he is not engaged. He will cause them one point of damage and then they will cease to panic. So obviously uh, the fear of him is greater than the fear of the walking dead themselves. And his leader ability is kill them all. So each time that the Brian Blake character successfully wounds an enemy survivor, he adds a white dice to his special pull, which collects on this card. Um, and then any model in Brian's group may add one of these dice to any attack roll. So it allows him to sort of boost up and power up on the back of his uh, meanness. So that's your Brian Blake character there. Uh, and then Gloria, which is the, uh, the other character that comes in the box there. Again, a good kind of um, character to tag along there, a marksman with uh, white and uh, dice for melee and shooting and a red in defence. And she has a special ability on there, Die Hard. So she deducts one point of damage inflicted against her in each melee. So there you go. So they're the two characters. And then obviously a little selection of equipment cards here. Obviously the required Mantic point, which you can save up and trade in with Mantic for some freebies. Uh, you also get an equipment card for a megaphone. This allows you to give a, a, another character within 10 inches an additional action on your turn, uh, but unfortunately obviously causes noise. <clears throat> we have Michonne's Katana. Okay. Some Riot Gear. And we also have a weapon, a ranged weapon, 15 inch range, the CX-4 Storm Assault Rifle, which obviously has the uh, multiple shots special rule, 
uh, and uh, is quite an effective looking uh, weapon. There you go. So I hope that helps. <coughs> Excuse me. I hope that helps identify what you're going to be getting in your packet. Um, as always, if you want to know more, you can visit us at www.tabletopheroes.co.uk or find Tabletop Heroes on Facebook. And uh, I hope to catch up with you soon. Take care. Thank you.